phone, I got options And I don't wanna tell you to drop it But I don't wanna play your fan Yeah, so What's good, y'all? It's your girl, Tame. I just woke up. It's Saturday, and I'm just gonna get myself together to go out. I got a few errands to run. I need to get on the camera and vent. Going back, looking at a lot of the, the videos I made in the past. A lot of the times where I picked up the camera, I was very cautious about my skincare and my own, like, imperfections on the camera. And as I look back on the videos and I reflect, I'm like, y'all are not watching the video just for me to look perfect. Thank you for being a loyal subscriber and not giving up on me. And if you are a new person watching this channel, my name is Tay. I go by Tay. My name is Tajay. Yeah, let me get dressed and continue with the day. We'll see y'all in the next clip. All right, y'all. So I took a shower. This is what I'm wearing for the day. Talk with my aunt today. It just inspired me to like be more of myself on camera. And because I realized watching my older videos, I just want to come on here and be myself and not have to worry about are they gonna like it? Are they gonna stay to watch? Are they gonna subscribe? I'm gonna still do some sit down talk videos, but it's not gonna be so serious. Forget all that. I'm just gonna keep giving y'all me. I'm trying to get to where I wanna be, and you guys are on this journey with me, and hopefully, on this journey, it can inspire you to do things you want to do too i'm going to show you guys what i've been using i went to my dermatologist um for the past couple years where my skincare has been at i have a lot of marks on my face that don't want to leave but i know that i have very oily skin so i've been struggling with just getting my skin back to like clear baby smooth and i realized that it is a hormonal acne issue um, it's something that if I'm eating certain things, it's going to increase my hormone levels and, you know, give me more acne. So I used to use Retin-A. Um, Retin-A, I just felt like wasn't doing anything much. I was on it for like a long time and I just felt like it wasn't working. I would, I would say up to a year, but it wasn't consistent. So I just told the doctor to prescribe me something else. Um, so this is what he prescribed me. Um, he prescribed me three things. So what I'm using in the morning, like I said, it's morning time. I just washed my face. I'm about to go outside. And he gave me this to use in the morning. This is azelaic acid gel, 15%. You can only get this by a doctor because the dosage is so high. So I just use a little bit of this. I just use a little. So he told me to do two dots on both cheeks, uh, two on top, and then one one two three four it's basically gone and that's all you need it's really like a pea size amount this is probably a little bit over pea size amount but that's also the same thing he told me to use for the tretinoin tretinoin cream this is a 0.5 because my skin is able to tolerate it more um my skin is very oily so he figured that you know my skin is more tolerable to a higher dosage and there are three dosages for tretinoin. You have the 0.25, the five, and the one, one being the strongest. So I got the 0.5, which is like the middle strength. And I thought like it was doing good for my skin. My skin didn't really have to adjust to it um, because I felt like it recognizes it. Like I'm not experiencing any like hard purging, any like super massive flakiness. I'm just purging. Like this pimple has gotten bigger because the stuff is getting ready to push out of the skin. And I got a few more coming into play over here as well. So I'm in the middle of the purging process and I will continue to post videos or compose post like pictures. I'm gonna um, take document every two weeks to see the, the process of it, but y'all can just see how it looks now starting. Y'all have a documented look of what it looks like. And this stuff dries pretty quick on my face. Spironolactone tablets, and that is a oral pill for acne. With these medications, you wanna make sure you're very, very hydrated throughout the day and you have sunscreen. So for my moisturizer, this has been working really, really well. I have not had any flakiness and I've been on tretinoin for about, I would say this is like my six, this is like a week now. It's probably making like a six day or a week. And this is the water bank Water Bank Blue Hyaluronic by Laneige. And this is super duper creamy. Um, it says Water Bank for a reason. It's very hydrating and hyaluronic acid is like, it has like water molecules to like increase the moisture, the moisture levels. It's thick, but it's not too thick. Like it's, it has a lot of slip to it. So I just take a little bit of this 
I don't even know why I did that. I usually just one, two, dab it on my face like I do the ointment. One, two, three. Really, I just rub it all over my skin. I just rub it all on my skin. But I don't use too much. I kind of use like a little bit more than a pea size because I'm going to be out all day. And I learned a trick, which is to put the moisturizer on first before you put on the creams so that you can trick the skin or create a barrier so it won't cause excess drying or like purging and like overreact to your skin and also let your skin dry before you put the the, the creams on but my bumps these two new bumps these red bumps just came in they hurt a little bit but it's okay because it's doing what it has to do my skin stays shiny all day too like moisturized not like oily shiny like it's like hydrated shiny so i like that my skin's like a, a little tacky because of the ointment i just forgot to show y'all the cleanser i'm using uh, you want to use something that is really really mild and um non-comedogenic which is great it doesn't clog the pores or i'll use the regular basic cetaphil as an alternative and now what i'm gonna do is put paula's choice 50. this is the spf of 50. this is a really good a uh, sunscreen sunblock it's very it's very protective because it has the highest pf let's do one two one two one um shouldn't do down there right but i'm gonna spread it out i'm just gonna rub that in i'm in a better space mentally I am more organized, I'm more planned. I feel like I'm more in control of my life. Like I wanna do a lot of self-care stuff. I wanna give y'all information on how to, you know, maintain your mental health, your mindset towards things and how you can actually reach the goals you wanna reach in becoming successful. I really hope y'all enjoy my personality. I'm a very unique individual and, you know, an acquired taste, I should say. I'm about to take this off, okay? For my last uh, YouTube short that I posted, it was my scalp being very dry. I think I found a remedy. What I've been using to stop my itching, this is a Saboric and Dermatitis Psoriasis Shampoo. I'm not sure if I have any of this. I don't know if I can give all the credit to this, but I do feel like it's helped a tad. So my mom had this Indian hemp um, hair treatment and she has a bigger size and I was using some and I felt like that's what my scalp needed just some type of moisture but like healthy moisture I haven't had any itching um, two days ago when I felt a little bit of an itch I put more on this and I still haven't felt anything two days later so that's what I've been using to get my scalp back under control my hair is still flourishing I give myself regular trims now I'm not even scared to like trim my hair I'm gonna show y'all how to make a, uh, a glueless wig look good this is a flat iron state but it's an old flat iron state let me get this way right playing with y'all my life update y'all i told myself like oh i don't want to post yet because i want more time but i do have time on the weekends i can post i can film next week i could take that time to edit and post see how i transform that okay this is just a quick run too i'm not staying outside i'm really not I like this shirt. I'm not putting no makeup on either because I got my medication on. But yeah, girl, do what you gotta do. Find ways to post, find ways. You do not have to be perfect to get on this YouTube stuff, child. People want to see you be yourself and they want to see you be a relatable individual, okay? But yeah, y'all, um, I'm about to head out and get my car things done. I have a lot of things to do. Um, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel if you like this video. It doesn't take too much to hit that button. And this is how you can hook it up real quick. Just get a little handkerchief. And that's it, baby. You ain't gonna do too much to do too less. I gotta brush my teeth, though. That's the one thing I gotta do before I leave. Y'all, I didn't brush my teeth. Please like. And let me just show y'all my quick outfit before I go out. Because I'm looking good today. So this is the outfit, y'all. But yeah, y'all, that's it. I'll probably be back. I'm really excited to get back in tune with y'all. And um, just subscribe to this channel because it's coming back bigger and better. And by the time I post my third video, y'all probably gonna wanna subscribe anyway. Okay, your girl's out. Bye. The door, but I forgot to show y'all my sneakers. Look at them. I just got them. They're so cute and they match my outfit. Two different socks on. I just realized that. Don't come for me in the comments. Don't come for me. It'll be alright. It's still cute. Alright, later.